children. Yes, Lord. Amen. Thank you. Amen. They sing us songs with meaning. Amen. Amen. They end up here just doing anything. Yes. Amen. And I think they get excited about being in the choir. Oh, yeah. So Very good. Well. I got some folks out there grown folks can sing in the choir stand. I don't know why they won't, but that's all right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna push these young folks. Amen. I'm gonna buy all of my shirt just alike. Amen. 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 Now, if y'all wanna help me buy them, I'll take your money. Well, all right. Well, all right. <laughs> amen. 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 I want all of them have them nice purple shirt. Yeah, I like purple. So like that. Amen. Oh, right. help Jesus. <laughs> amen. All right, y'all. It's time for the morning message. Right. Lamentations, the third chapter. Oh, somebody said I ain't singing. I wouldn't, but I guess I will. <laughs> the blood that Jesus shed for me
to y'all this morning about God's favor. Yes. Come on, give the Lord a hand this morning. God's favor. God's favor. God's favor. Anybody here besides me got God's favor? Amen. 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 Hey, I know you got it. Yeah. Amen. I look back just a few months ago, and you have to be reminded sometimes. God is still in the blessing business. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. And we often miss Mother Jones an opportunity to praise the Lord. Well, all right. Donnelly said, woke up this morning with my mind. I'm going to tell you why I said that. Because somebody laid down last night troubled. Yes, Lord. And they tossed and turned yes, all night long. Yes, Lord. And we, what, what did you say in verse 23? They are new, new. every morning. Amen. He knew when you laid down last night, you had trouble in your heart. Amen. But even though you tossed all night long, Amen. he woke you up this morning. Yes, all right. Yes, and it says, uh, great. He is the faithful. Thank you. Now, I want y'all to uh, remember this. Kim, you in my way. <laughs> so I'll be walking. It's far enough, by the way. I ain't going to kill you. This kid might get me. <laughs> the Murray siblings donated this flower to First Baptist in honor of Kim. Amen. 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 You ain't supposed to move this flower too much, right, Shirley? But I don't know if he's going to stay there or not. Well, I might leave it alone. But look at what he says here. The Lord, look at 24, is my portion. What's that? God got my back. Amen. The Lord is my portion. He got me. Amen. Now, Thank you. Thank you. I got to check the church mother. I'm not important. Uh-oh. But sometimes I am busy. Amen. Now, while she talked about me, she said, I'm going to talk about her because I'm going to straighten her out in public because she tried to call me out in public. Well, all right. I had pipes burst in my house twice. Uh-oh. Yes, Lord. I thought my kitchen was Niagara Falls the other day. Well. I, well, I said, what's that noise? I go in there and the water just goes. I said, Lord, I'm burst. I just had the pipes fixed two weeks ago. But you know what? It's still all right. Amen. <laughs> because I look and I remember, Brother Ray, there was a tsunami and folks were not able to control the stream of the water and they drowned. Amen. 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 Pastor Lane, I got a little wet, you know. Yeah, I got a little wet, but it didn't drown me. I ain't going to tell a lie. I got a little despondent, too, because it, it whooped up. I find in a law that when I would do good, evil is ever present with me. And I want you to understand here of the crowd, sometimes evil is stuff. Yes. yes. See, we always think evil is people. Sometimes yes. stuff yes. is evil because I didn't need to be filled with no water and they're cold. And it was like 17 degrees there. Amen. Wow. Amen. Yeah. I said, Lord Jesus. And I, you know, if you ever try to get water up without a shop back, Forget about a mop, it ain't gonna help you. Amen. I grab every towel we had in the house. Oh. <laughs> I put the throw the towel down there and it's not side. And some said, put the towel in the thing that you do the mop. Ran it out and throw it back. I must have did that for four hours. <laughs> <laughs> and then about eight o'clock at night, I got so sick. Mm. And I didn't say nothing. I just got in the bed. Right. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta go lay down. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. yes, sir. But Donna, I woke up the next morning I was refreshed. Well, all right. And then I took all needs to work Friday. Soon I sit in the chair, she calls me on the phone, Tommy, you need to get back to uh, Charleston and pick a hand Larry's not doing good. You gotta go to Ash. Mm. <clears throat> you know I haven't had my 10 o'clock nap. <laughs> <laughs> I said, Lord, give me strength. Yes, yes. I love Larry. Larry's my brother. I don't have no in-laws. I love Larry, and it bothered me. 
Because I told him when he left here Tuesday, I said, Lord, get yourself together. I can't take nothing else right now. Kim was enough. And when they said he wasn't responding, I had to drive all the way to Ashley not knowing what I was going to find. But then all of a sudden, Mother Jones, God come to me and said, not yet. Yeah. <laughs> and I said, I think I've been preaching that about four weeks. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Not yet. Yeah. And so when I get there, everybody in the wait room, everybody in the wait room. So I said, Lord, say, sit down. Why don't you go back there? So finally, the chaos calmed down. <laughs> and I said, well, I said, well, ain't nobody back there. I said, let me go back here. I'll go back there. What you doing now? He was talking, but he wasn't talking before. Well, yeah. see? See? Understand, we got to stop panicking and keep trusting. Amen. Because God already, Jesus knows all about our struggle. Lord, have mercy. And it don't make no difference what the doctor say, what the flu say, what pneumonia say. Jesus got the last word. But I told our niece, no. we're going to ask them to see about Larry. I told a friend, I said, we're going to ask them to see about Larry tomorrow. See, usually I ask, but I didn't ask this time. <laughs> well, she know I am about Larry. So we went down to see about Larry. We walk in the room, and Larry, I know you're watching, you make me sick. Oh. <laughs> I walk in there, he had two plates of food. <laughs> but he was eating, and he was hey, eating, man. and wasn't nobody feeding him, he was feeding himself. Hey. Hey. Grace and mercy. 
And you know what I thank God about grace and mercy? I don't care what we think we had, he'll find us. Oh, yes. yes he will. Uncover his face over there in that corner over there. Amen. Amen. I'm going to start sitting up here with me. Let's look at what God is saying to us. Issues are real. Amen. 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 Yeah. Issues can cause havoc. Yeah. And the thing that I want you to understand about God's grace and mercy, watch me say, this I recall to my mind, therefore, have I hope. Mm -hmm. The old folks say, Glenn, my hope is built. Nothing less. That Jesus loved. And his righteousness. They say, I dare not trust dare not. the sweetest friend. <laughs> but holy lean on Jesus. You got to know him. Amen. Now, you might not even get me on the phone, but thank God he tore the curtain down. You can call him for yes, yourself. Hello. Hello. Now, I'm going to tell you something. You might not even get a hold of me, but whether you know or not, I pray for y'all every day. Amen. And I don't wait till something go wrong to pray for you early Amen. in the morning. Amen. Now, I need to come out. She get up at 4.30. I'll be up right behind her, sometimes before her. But when she leaves, back in the chair or the bed, I go. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Now, sometimes I try to be cutie, but the other crowd, and I make the bed up before she leaves. <laughs> that means I'm going in a living room. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But I want you to understand, God sees and knows what you're going through. Amen. Now, here's, here, here's the key to us to understand something. You ain't going to stay unless you choose to have a pity party. Uh-oh. Yeah. But when you are in issues, if you keep trusting in the Lord and you say your prayer, and watch this, pray before stuff happens. Amen. 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 Because what God knows is, day by day, hmm. you're going to walk into something. Oh, yes. Yeah. And I, I want y'all to get the frame of mind. And, I, and the Lord gonna bless. The Lord gonna bless. I ain't telling y'all that because some of y'all know it. Y'all just the Lord gonna bless. Amen. And when He does, you ought to be able to walk into His house. Yes. Yes. Already mm. excited. Amen. Amen. About coming into His house. Amen. And so I read that. I was glad when they said unto me, "Let us go into the house of the Lord." I'm going to be all right. No, you're going to hell. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. 
I don't care how much y'all need to get up here and testify and do what she do. I got to do what God tell me. Amen. 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 Ain't nobody ran nowhere in the Bible. When you get to the gate, you can grab nobody's coat and drag in behind them. You got to be the dumb trumpet and have a relationship with Jesus Christ for yourself. So when you get inside the gate, he won't say, depart from me, you workers of iniquity. I don't even know you. Watch this, Ray. Oh, Lord, Glenn, I'm stirring it up this morning. Oh, what is man that yeah. says thou art mindful of him? Yes. Or the son of man that thou visitest him not? Mm -hmm. You got to know God for yourself. Yes. Yes. And you know, let me tell you something. If you're over 12 years old, you ain't got no excuses. Uh oh. Uh -oh. You done heard enough about Jesus by now when you can say, thank you, God. Could have been dead, <laughs> sleeping in my grave. I don't care how you dress up either. That's right. Just yeah. because you got a cross around your neck, they don't get you nowhere. Yeah. Sometimes yeah. they cross be choking you, you do it. Yeah. Here we are. Morning. Yes. High morning. Yes, Lord. Yes, yes. New mercy. Hmm. Ray, when I first read this Thank about 40 years ago, I said, I don't understand it. You know why they don't stand? Hadn't been through nothing. That's right. Yeah. But now. Amen. Oh, I can talk about it all day long. Amen. And you know what else? I can close the Bible and talk about it all day long. Uh-oh. Because one thing I know for sure, it was, uh, okay, he'll give you a good doctor. He'll give you a good nurse. He'll give you a praying wife. But if you don't add Jesus in there to put the icing on the cake, okay. you just got all that other stuff. Amen. <laughs> Worrying about my brother because he lives again. Oh, I want to see him look upon his face. Not yet, though. Y'all yes. stop saying it. <laughs> Not yet, though. Not yet. To everything, mm -hmm. there is a season. Yes. Yes. And, and you know, I'll tell y'all something. Why don't y'all start plugging in your spiritual discernment? Uh-oh. Instead of plugging in fear and word. Yeah. Uh -oh. All right. And say, what'd you say, Jesus? All right. Uh -huh. And he'll answer you. Uh -huh. I'm gonna tell you something. Death really shouldn't sneak up on us. Mm -hmm. Not, Not nobody in our family, but because we, we got to stay focused. Amen. Amen. I'm gonna tell you what the problem is. My beautiful child is my elder me. I need another one, another color. <laughs> You're not a pastor. <laughs> Here's what I want y'all to do. Sometimes you have to block yourself. Yes, yes. And tell the Lord to hide you. Oh, that's scripture. The Lord is my life and my salvation. Who shall I be? The Lord is the strength of my life. Oh, who shall I be? When the wicked, my enemies, even my foes, came up on the eat of my flesh, they stumbled and fell. Though a whole city cap against me, my heart shall now fail. What thing hmm. have, I, have I desired of the Lord that when I see that I may dwell in the house of the Lord? And what is he going to do? He going to hide me oh, yes. in his pavilion. Y'all ain't know what a pavilion is. Uh-oh. Yeah. You got to get in that word. Amen. Yeah. Come here thinking the preacher going to say, sometimes the preacher that had a rough week too. Amen. Now I'm gonna say, I'm gonna tell you, I know who prayed for me and who don't. Amen. Yeah, I do. Because sometimes stuff overtakes your spiritual walk. Yes. Mm -hmm. And if we ain't praying one for the other before we need to call them. Because the Bible says pray in season and out season. That's right. So you might not get me on the phone, but Jesus put it in my heart. Amen. Amen. And I'm going to tell y'all something. Y'all ain't messing with no chump. I'm really, I'm seriously, and I truly walk with the Lord. I'm the same every day. Amen. Amen. And I, but listen, Angie with her message self, my niece, not you, Angie. I'm going to say, yes. Put me in some jeans. 
Just because I stopped wearing jeans don't mean I didn't do I lost my anointing. I can praise you and ain't by my cloak. Just because I got a cross, it ain't got nothing to do with my holiness. Because one thing I can say, I can be in the shower, and, and uh, all these you, she ain't never said nothing in these 10 years, but you know, I'm actually saying, God, he ain't never preaching again. <laughs> well, Lord. Well. And be careful what y'all say around me, because I will take what you say and make a sermon out of it. Well. Come on. Well. Yeah. Yeah. You know why? Because you have to feed people where they are. Amen. Amen. There you are. Yes. You know, if you don't like Chinese food, <laughs> and somebody say, I'm going to take you out there anywhere you want to go. And then, and then you say, okay, good. We're going down to uh, Olive Garden. Oh, no, we're going up to the chapel. I, did, I don't like food. <laughs> and I'm going to say something. It might hurt somebody's feelings, but sometimes we need to hurt folks' feelings. We're too nice. Amen. If you say you're helping somebody, and after you help them, and you got to bug them because you helped them, you didn't help them. You are a hypocrite. Say this, I'm gonna say this until it gets in y'all head. Ain't no such thing as no self made nothing. That's right. Yes, very much so. Now, some of us are independent. Yeah. But look back why you became that way. Because yes. somebody let you down. Amen. And you say, I ain't fooling with them no more. I'm gonna do it myself. <laughs> well, all y'all independent folks, guess what? I ain't independent. I asked for some help in a minute. <laughs> Hello. Well. And I'm going to tell you something. If you are so independent, can you die for yourself? No. Can you save yourself? No. Did you hang on the cross for yourself? No. Don't they throw that out there? Mm -hmm. Yes, very much so. I don't care what you say, Murray. I'm still independent. Nice. You need the Lord. Yes, you need the Lord. Oh, okay, listen, here's the way. You can have all the money in the world mm -hmm. yes, and still need some help. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Hey, Amen. hey. Now, and you're looking at somebody who had a whole bunch of money, but I had a whole lot of misery too. Mm -hmm. I wasn't happy. But look at me now. Amen. Amen. Thank you. I better give out a smile. I forgot they didn't mess with my mouth, so I don't want to smile too wide. <laughs> I don't want to smile too wide. Expose what's been gone. <laughs> but I smile because the Lord has really blessed me with a wonderful wife. Amen. Amen. I wish I would have had it. Yes, you better back the one. And the Lord, listen, the Lord has blessed me with two wonderful churches. Amen. 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 I want to say something to y'all. I don't think I'm important. I don't think I'm bad. I don't think I'm no better than nobody else. But guess what? Ain't nobody no better than me. Amen. 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 No, 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 no. And I thank God I'm surrounded by people that ain't going to let me fall. Amen. Oh, yeah. I get weak sometimes and want to throw in the towel. Throw in the trace. Amen. I ain't coming back. I'm done. <laughs> the shell won't be boiling no more. <laughs> who you call? I'm leaving. But I ain't going to put no note on the table for you. All right. Because I ain't going nowhere. Amen. All right. Amen. You know what the Lord has been showing me? We look for the wrong stuff. Mm -hmm. It's time out to stop worrying about the dollar. Mm. Worry about the souls. Yes, mm. yes, you know what I found out? If you worry about the souls, God will give you the dollars. Yes. Hey, whoa. Yes. What? My God. Yes. According to his riches and glory. And you know what I found out, Tracy? He'll make somebody walk up in places that don't even like him. Hello, Glenn. Amen. Amen. You know how I know how to live? I know for a fact somebody couldn't stand me. But found out later on that I wasn't who they thought I was and became the best room I ever had in my 35 years of pastor. And all I can do is say, God will open up the love flow and make it run when you think hate is bad. Amen. Oh, yeah, that's going Do I have the right Bible? Let me see if I can get y'all something. What time is it? 
Superboy until six thirty, so y'all calm down. <laughs> Your team ain't in the Super Bowl, no way. Really? Wait a minute, I'm sorry, David. David said, mine is and they're going to win. <laughs> David, I love you, but I hope they don't. I hope you team leads. All right, now listen. When you talk about love, I done lost it. But, no, I got that. Listen. Love and hatred are married. Mm -hmm. Amen. The way hatred becomes hatred mm -hmm. is because love that got frustrated. Yeah, yeah. I know y'all didn't understand that. Right. You ever have frustrated love? Yeah, yeah. Now see, here's what's wrong with y'all. Y'all always looking for kissy kissy. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sometimes people you in a relationship can frustrate you so bad. My Lord. I ain't talking about your wife or your children. I'm talking about people you interact with. Okay, I'm going to bring it to your home plate. When you're on your job. Come on, come on. All right. 20 times a day you want to knock somebody out. Amen. Good morning. What? <laughs> Where my donuts? Buy your own donuts. Really? So, frustration makes you think you hate something. But you love it. And you're just mad about it. Now, I want to give y'all something else free. I'll give y'all one thing free. You don't give it two or three today. But watch this. Whenever you realize you got God's favor, God will show you how to bless somebody else through your testimony. Amen. Amen. Now, I'm going to shock them. Destiny, you ain't got to open your mouth to have a testimony. Amen. That's right. That's right. Amen. Watch this. Just walk. Mm -hmm. And somebody Amen. ought to see Jesus in you. Amen. 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 And I keep telling y'all, Jesus ain't got nothing to do with your clothes. That's okay. right. Amen. <laughs> Well, I want to kill you. Y'all remember that Sunday I see it, somebody about red bottoms? Say, what? Women going to get them red bottoms? And I didn't even know it. I'm sitting up here and had on some red bottom men's shoes. Didn't even know it. <laughs> well, I didn't even know they made red bottoms for me, right? I got two pairs. Didn't know it. I don't think they mean nothing, though. I think somebody just read out what color to put on the bottom. <laughs> Y'all start laughing at me. Great is thy faithfulness. Now, since you know you got God's favor, how come he can't get your praise? Uh-oh. Mm -hmm. All right. Ooh, what's quiet in here? Say it, say it. <laughs> say it. In the 80s, they sung a song. I think Fantasia sung it. What more could it do? Huh? <laughs> what else God got to do for us? My Lord. Now, I'll tell y'all something. Y'all, some of y'all find y'all income tax, and if it don't come back like you said on the paper, y'all gonna be upset. <laughs> that might be it. But you ain't gotta get upset, because there's a verse in here, Philippians says, but my God shall supply. Yes, it does. Yes, yes, if your income tax don't come back right, you still are blessed, you still are provided for, you're not hungry, you still got clothes on your back, God still makes a way for you to eat, so you still can say, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Now, let me tell you something. If I change your income tax check, come back right. Don't be thinking Trump or nobody else. I know that's right. <laughs> Amen. Amen. And I'll tell y'all something now. Don't be cheating. <laughs> if it ain't truth, don't put it down. Amen. Amen. That's right. And then, I think they took it away now. Charity for, you know, paying tithes and, 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 and giving donations to uh, other stuff, charitable. Yeah. I think they took that away. But I'm going to tell y'all something. Some of y'all be saying, I put five thousand dollars in church last year. You ain't put five thousand dollars in church in twenty years. Oh, allow God like that. They think they still got them uh, back when we were growing up, Shalane. You know, y'all know Michelle. They used to, and Shirley. You know, they used to pass out them things, and you put a, a nickel, a dime, or a quarter in it, and you turn it in every so often. Think you done done something for the house of the Lord? All right. Look, Rick, about it here. Pray for me, brother. <laughs> That's the truth. And then, we're going to work on a project. Put the little thing up on the wall with the little glass and say you're going to reach $10,000. I'll never put one on the wall. <laughs> and uh, wait on folks to start making them, filling it in. After three or four weeks go by and you see it's still clear. 
Mm-hmm. You don't have to do that. All you have to do is do what God tells you to do. That's right. And I'm telling you, see, mm-hmm. I ain't selling no chicken. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm not having no barbecues. Uh-oh. We ain't having no cakewalks. Uh-huh. Talking about a cakewalk at five dollars. Man, I don't make now cake for no five dollars. Because <laughs> I don't fool with Betty. Uh-uh. My cakes are time. Uh-uh. Yeah, I'm talking about Betty Crocker, so y'all act like y'all do <laughs> So, God is saying this to us. And I, y'all need to write this down in your Bible. Anyway, invest in your salvation. Amen. Yeah, I, I might have to preach that. But I need you to invest in your salvation from the aspects of you knowing you got God's favor. And since you know you got God's favor, again, why can't you just give God his praise? Come on. Uh-oh. Come on. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah. Well, I, now, I want you to pay attention. That child right there inspires me every time Amen. she walks in the door. Amen. Amen. We got to stay and support her because she gonna be something great. Yes, sir. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yes, she is. Oh yeah. Amen, amen. I'm gonna pay you to do a testimony class. <laughs> Cause when she testifies, she keeps God in the focus. Amen, amen. She talks about different things, but it always says, "But God." Yes. We need to get to a place in our spiritual world. But, but God, I, I, I ain't got no money, but, but, but God. I, uh, what, 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 what about God? I know Tracy, I know Shirley, I know David, I know Arnie, I know Ray, I know Donna. I know Mother Jones. Uh oh. What you mean? We have to surround ourselves yes. with love. Amen. Amen. And love ain't going to let you be hungry. Amen. Uh-huh. Now, I'm going to tell y'all something about this being hungry stuff. <laughs> If you spiritually hungry, come on, come on. you can eat all the physical food you want. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You still gonna starve. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Amen. Blessed are they that hunger and thirst after righteousness. Lord. For they shall be filled. Amen. Now, if you pay attention, y'all get a buffet every Sunday. Amen. Yes, Amen. 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 And for those of y'all watching that ain't bragging, that's just standing on what God has blessed me to be able to do. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Amen. Because I can wake up and don't have no mind anymore. Yeah. But if you want to take my mind, you know what I want? I, I still want to be able to just do this. <laughs> Sometimes you ain't got to say nothing. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And it go right back. Jesus knows. Sometimes everybody seems like they've gone. We just keep looking. <laughs> what is it? I'm gonna lift up my eyes. Sometimes I can't get my pastor, but I gotta lift up my eyes. Amen, amen. There's gonna be a whole amen. bunch of y'all ain't gonna be able to get me. Well. But I've already prayed for you early in the morning. Amen. I prayed for you when I lay down last night. Amen. And you know what? I pray for you while I'm having my dreams. I dream about church all the time. Yes, I do. Yeah. And sometimes I'll be saying, whoa. Yeah. You know, what do you call it? Deja vu? Mm-hmm. I don't know what it is. You know, I don't know if it's spiritual or not. <laughs> but it's a vision that comes to life. Yeah. Let's just put it like that. Forget to move out Deja Do you have God's favor? Are you praising him when you realize it? Listen, let me say something to you. Stop praising God and looking for something. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> See, I didn't tell them that was free, David, but it was. If you have really walked in the shadow of the Almighty, you by now ought to know that if you praise Him, something's already on the way. And watch this. How about us just praise Him for what He already done? Because what God got for me Amen. is coming to my doorstep. Amen. 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 You know what? I tell everybody. See, 
See, Kathy is so, so blessed. That stuff on the kitchen, I remember when she put it up, and Mr. Eugene said, there's 22 toppings on there. <laughs> but you know what? I want y'all to see something. When you look at pictures of people, look at different stages. I found a picture the other day, Kathy, I don't remember you took it. I was coming down that aisle, full-blown cancer, looking grayish, and she snapped my picture. If y'all saw Facebook, I used it this, this morning. So I said, uh, from this to stage three cancers. The next picture was a couple of weeks ago when I had on my red suit. Don't say nothing. Don't, don't hate it. And I said, still looking up to him. And then I had all y'all in the picture and I was praising the Lord and up here preaching and said, well, you can praise God through all your storms. Yeah. I got a question for y'all. You heard Brother Ray say on the 15th, he going to get a pacemaker. Yeah. Oh, the devil is alive. Yeah. Okay. But God told me right when you said it, he said, no, I'll give you a pacemaker when the doctor told you you need one. Yeah. Amen. 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 And, and some of y'all sanctified folks out there in, in, in online land and all that stuff, let me tell y'all something. Sometimes you have to have stuff altered because God has provided these things to help us keep living. Stop being so sanctified and your foolish self go to die because I ain't taking that medicine. I'm taking mine. Amen. And somebody, I'm, yeah, it's, it, uh, she already know. I, I'm going to say it anyway. I got a bad cold. Y'all want to talk about somebody going in the store and getting some liquor for a cold, mm -hmm. but you drink NyQuil like it ain't nothing. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Read the ingredients. Uh -oh. What's in NyQuil? Justification. Oh, oh, doctor, I need some of that cough syrup with some codeine in it. <laughs> Don't get no idea of the testing. Don't get no idea. So listen. Whatever go on in your life, pray. Yeah. And sometimes sickness will overtake you. Yeah. And I'm going to tell y'all something. If y'all sick and you know you're sick, stay, stay at home. Yes. Thank you, Thank That's why we got in there, right, Kathy? Yes. Don't worry about you coming in here hawking and coughing in our face. Oh, <laughs> and you be first going to want to hug and kiss on somebody. <laughs> Keep your germs to your side. Thank you, sir. Surely bring us a box of them things. What do you call them? Mask. Yeah. Come on, with these gloves too. Yes, Lord. All right. Y'all, 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 y'all do this for me. I'm, I'm done. Watch this. Great, great, great is our God. Is our God. And we thank Him. And we thank Him for His favor. For His favor. Give the Lord a hand clap. I'm done. Surprisingly. Maybe before one o'clock. All right, y'all come to the altar. Don't, don't take too long because it's going to be one of them short prayers. <laughs>